morning, everybody. Um, it's about 11 o'clock here. Um, Tuesday morning. I just got done. I had to go on base to go to the pharmacy and stuff like that. And it's raining. That's why I actually have makeup on and I'm doing a video because I actually had to go somewhere. Um, yes, I know. I just don't know if my face is darker than right here. I said put powder right here. to, But I guess maybe it came off or something. I just need to go ahead and put some self tanner on or something already. I'm tired of trying to match everything. Anyway, so I had to go to a base and go to the pharmacy and then I went and got a peppermint mocha latte. I haven't had Starbucks in a while, so that's kind of a treat for me. Um, so I wasn't able to have coffee this morning. I kind of got storm on the bus and then got dressed and then got to sit and wait two hours in the pharmacy, pretty much, for my medication. Anyway, so I figured, um, it's really ucky outside. After I'm doing the video, I'm going to start cleaning and stuff. Um, I figured I would do a video of some of the scents I just purchased for Scentsy. First, I do have to state I am a Scentsy consultant. Um, I bought everything with my own money. These are my own opinions. And I will link my website down below if you would like to browse or order something. Um, so first I'll start with the scents that are going to be discontinued starting March 1st. Starting March 1st, you cannot get these. Um, some of them might be brought back for the fall and winter season, but um, sometimes because you don't want to chance it. So I kind of stocked up on my favorite pumpkin roll um, because it's my favorite. So first I will start with Central Park Praline. This one, yes, it will be discontinued um, starting March 1st. You will not be able to get it. Um, I don't know if it's going to be brought back for the next fall winter season. So just as of right now, as of March 1st, you can't get it on the website, basically. Hopefully, it will be brought back um, in the next fall and winter season. So it smells like... If you're in the mall and they have those cashews, that are those cashews and peanuts and nuts that are like um, roasted with sugar and cinnamon, that's what it smells like. It smells really, really, um, so it's definitely a food scent for sure. And it's very sweet. The next one is Cerise, or Cerise. This to me is a fruit floral this one's really nice. I like in the bathroom or a bedroom. But I wouldn't put this in the kitchen. Or even the living room, I don't think. I would put this, yeah. Because to me, it's a, 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 it's like, I don't know. It's like a spa scent to me or something. So I would put it upstairs in the bedroom or the bathroom. Somewhere it's like relaxing. And it has a really pretty purple color. The next one is Dominica, and this one, it's a very unique scent to me, that's why I like it. There's fig in here, and I believe nutmeg as well is one of them, so it's a very um, exotic scent to me. Yeah, it's like big and nutmeg and um, yeah and the color is so pretty it's like a pretty purple color it's really dark deep purple so pretty the next one is honey pear cider I have this one burning in my warmer in my kitchen right now and um, it's so uh, comforting it's just warm and just oh it just smells so good <laughs> I put two in my Walmart because I already know I like it. I've had two bars of this already. Mm. It's just, it just, yeah, it smells like cider. It, but instead of apple, it's pear cider. It's, it just smells so good. And it's like a rainy day outside. It's not too cold. It's about 50 degrees, but it's raining. And I just wanted something like, oh, it's comfortable and warm and cozy. Now the last one is pumpkin roll. Um, I did just order one of these, but this is my second one. 
And I will save this one for the fall, just in case they don't bring it back. Some people, and to me, this is a perfect bakery pumpkin scent for the fall and winter, or for an everyday me. <sighs> it just smells so good. And then the next ones I ordered, um, I'm going to be doing my first, I had my launch party, but I booked a party. My first party is going to be um, March 9th. So I wanted to make sure I did have the scent trend. And what, this is the scent trend for 2013 with Violet Leaf. And because um, I don't have a tester for it or anything, so I wanted to make sure at least I had the bar. To me, this smells so good just by itself, too. It's a clean, fresh, floral, greeny scent. It smells green. Like, it smells like it's a nice spring or summer day, and you open up the windows, and it's just, it smells really nice. I would use this one in every room of the house. So this one also is for you to mix with other scents. That are in the new catalog. And if you look in the, well, I have the new catalog, I just don't have it next to me right now. But um, in the Mart, in the new spring summer catalog, they'll have a little, this little symbol right here next to it. And that means it's a good scent to mix with, with the, um, with the scent trend with Violet Leaf. So I'll move on next to, this is the scent of the month right now. We are in February, and it is Cozy Peach. Now, this is one of the scents that they recommend mixing with the scent trend. And Cozy Peach just smells absolutely delicious. It smells like you're in a peach orchard. You're picking it from the tree. You're cutting it. Um, there's the leaves. There's like a leaf on the peach. Like, you bit into the peach, and it's just like, um, juicy and like flavorful and it's just that's what it smells like to me <laughs> and I ordered one of these so then if somebody wanted to um, this will be like the hostess gift or if somebody wanted to buy it because I'm thinking I'm trying to think what I'm going to do as a hostess gift I know I will do one of the scents of the month for March which is hello yellow and then I don't know what else and then, so those are the two that I really want to show you. The other two that I ordered, they're just always in the um, catalog. And it's Rio Beach. And this one smells good. It smells like summer coconut. Um, laying on the beach with the tropical drink type thing. But this one smells really, really nice if you like those type scents. Skinny dipping. I smell this. So many times before, and I never really um, liked it. And then I just recently smelled it because I was packing everybody's orders and stuff. And one of the girls, she ordered skinny dipping. And I'm like, what is that melon smell? I keep smelling this really pretty note that I can smell. Because when you get a box full of orders, there's all these scents. You can smell all these scents. Like the box just smells like scentsy. It's so cool. And I'm like, what is that scent? So I went upstairs into my guest bedroom and I was sniffing through my tester, smelling everything. I was like, it's skinny dipping this whole time. This is the scent that I keep smelling. And it does, it has like a melon note into it. And I love melon, honeydew melon, cantaloupe melon, um, watermelon. Like I love any of those scents. And that's what it is. <laughs> and it smells so good. So that is that. I'm just trying to do a quick video and stuff like that. But um, if you guys have any questions or anything, just go ahead and message me, comment below, whichever you like, and I will try to get back to you as soon as possible.